Hey everybody, the Bonga's back. Welcome to part 24 of Let's Play Banjo Tooie, brought to you by GameAnyone.com. Apparently, that dragon wanted to uh, greet the video as well. So I guess I can go up here. Okay, that's cool. I thought it'd be a bit too hot for me. All right, let's go up here. Looks like I'm climbing some kind of ruins. Is there anything else up here? No. All right, I really gotta get used to Hailfire Peaks. I mean, there's a lot for me to explore right now. And it looks like I'm still climbing this mountain. Something's gonna pop up over there, isn't there? Whoa! Okay, that almost got me. Man, it's gonna be very annoying to see, like, fireballs come at you, like, every ten seconds. Oh, hello, there's a move! You won't be needing that. Oh, okay. Banjo needs this one. Wait, is it Banjo that needs it? Yeah, it is Banjo. You, you can just tell sometimes. Okay, how the hell is Banjo gonna get up there then? Well, let me try going here first. Looks like I can do something here. This looks like a Colosseum. No, I'm just on the regular lava side again. Uh, where on the map is this to then? Looks like I'm around some kind of lava pool. Obviously, I don't want to jump in, because if I do, I'll probably die. Maybe I can go over here. Yeah, let's do that. Whoa, you almost got me. Oh, hang on a second, I'm... Oh, no, we're back to normal now. Like, I was losing some frames like crazy, and I was thinking it had something to do with being in here. Did I ever trigger this warp? No, I didn't. Ah, you ass! I knew the Wonder Wing would be good for something. Ha <laughs> ha! This looks like another hot water pool. Warning, trespassers in the exceedingly hot water are likely to be cooked. I don't want to be cooked. Thank you very much. Okay, this looks like it takes you to the icy side. I want to, like, explore as much as I can around the fire side first. Before we actually leave. And see what we can do about that move. I don't know if there's a way to just get over there, but we'll give it a shot. Have I been on this side? Feels like I haven't. Okay, what is that? That looks like a gargoyle. Did I just kill the gargoyle? Like, I just drilled him right in the head? <laughs> Hilarious. Okay, I'm inside the volcano, and it looks like I'm not safe here. That's where I hit all these switches. Um, do I have to hit them all at once, though? Like, maybe if I just leave and come back... Nah, you know what, I'm not gonna bother with that, because I seem to be doing fine in terms of, like, how much air I have. All I have to do is just keep hitting every switch that appears. Worst case scenario, I just get knocked into the lava. And I see three signs that I can't do anything with right now. But I also see a honeycomb piece. Let's see if I can go for it. Uh, maybe I should not drop from here. I also notice that you're not consuming air as fast as you would underwater. Okay, that's four. And there's the fifth one. I'll go for that honeycomb piece later. Right now, we got priorities to deal with. Which, thankfully, I can make it to by doing that kind of leap. Okay, that should take you over there. Oh, and there's yet another button. This one actually has a, a jiggy symbol on it. Okay, I really don't like that dude on the carpet. 
It's really pissing me off right now. Wait, where is the button to again? There it is. It's right over here. Okay, grab the jiggy before you die. Oh, you can get to those signs now. Right now, I could not care less. I'm just gonna go back this way to recover my air, and then I'm just gonna go back inside the volcano. Okay, so we got one jiggy here. That's progress. We didn't die. That's good. I prefer to not die. I'm gonna go back for that honeycomb piece, too, and see what's up on the icy side. I don't think you have to hit those buttons again. No, you don't. That's good. I had to think you'd have to do all this again. Just for what, like three signs? Ugh, you asshole. For like three signs, and a honeycomb piece, and another way into the icy side of this level. Hot Link's cold in the skull and wigwam! Okay, well, I already know about that. Only a ball of great size can start the oil drill. Okay. When things get too hot, remember your bearded buddy. Bearded buddy? Oh, okay, I think I know what they mean. I think they're talking about Gobi because he has a beard now. Good for him. That makes him popular among the ladies now. Not to mention he's a camel. They like riding things. No, camels don't like riding things. I mean, that'd be weird. Wait a minute, how the hell do I get up here then? Can I make that? Well, not if I do something that dumb. Oh, this is trash right now. You need to actually make the jump. Just thought I'd let you know. Rather than, you know, just walk right off. I could have swore I made that jump. Timing is very picky sometimes. Make it, make it. Okay, you can grab onto that. That's a bit of a cheeky way to make it over here, but we did it. Now, let's see what's over here. Up on the icy side. Icicle Grotto? Wow, you did- Oh! There was another one. You're gonna get got now. For pulling that stunt. Okay, I figured you would attack as well. Okay, there's eggs here too. You just gotta break the ice. Huh. I know what they can do about breaking the ice, huh, ladies? Uh... Are those feathers? No, that's a treble clef. I would like to get that. Can I get that? No. You die. Okay, where do I spawn to then? Still in the icicle? No! I spawn over here now. That's unfortunate. Well, let's see what we can do about getting that move right now. We're gonna split up right away. The upper area, that's where I want to go. Good. Now, can I get that move this way? I don't think the dragon has been pissed off yet. At least I would hope not. Okay, I can't... don't want to go through there. Because the move I need is not on the icy side, it's on the fire side. Camera angles, please, work with me here. Nope, you're not chasing me. I am surprisingly faster than you. That's right, you back away now. You know what's up. Okay, how do I get there? Looks like that might be a way. God, the camera angles are so bad. Okay, at least I won't fall completely if I go here. Just retrace my steps a little bit. 
I almost did not make that. Oh, I can't reach that? Really? Oh, man. I, I need to get up there. Like, how else am I gonna get up there? I mean, come on now. Is that really the only way I can get through? Looks like it. Let me... Good job. How is that like a heavy fall? I landed in lava. I'm gonna die, aren't I? I was going to recover, and then I just well, sob in a corner, submerged in lava. That's how it works. Good job, Banjo. That's GG. <laughs> uh, I guess we'll just uh, try going this way again. What if I go the opposite side? Let me try that. Like, rather than go that way, I'll go in this direction. What difference will it make? Surely I can still get to where I need to be. Hopefully. It's a stretch, but we'll try it. Okay, good, I was able to leap over that. Am I just gonna end up back to where I started? No, it can't be. Let me just keep going in this direction then. See what difference that makes. Wait, maybe this is where I need to go. Hopefully I don't get knocked off or anything. That would be terrible. No, no, no! You ass! All that progress gone down the drain. My god. All it takes is one little slip up. And then you'll lose it all. That's just bad. It's like click clock wood all over again. Make like one little mistake and then bam, you're dropping. You're dropping hard, faster than Enron stock. Are we still kicking them while they're down? I, I like to believe so. Or maybe that's just a very dated reference. It probably is very dated, so I'll show myself on the way out. Oh, that dragon's mad. I gotta keep myself moving at a steady pace. I mean, the thing that's so annoying is that dragon is going to be attacking while I'm waiting here. Okay, don't make that same mistake twice. There's still more hands. There we go. Finally did it. This one makes you safe and small. Two fit through gaps in a wall. First hold set and press C down. Protected in the liquids you will be. That's not how it rhymes. Did, they, did you say like down C? That does not sound right. Ow. Okay, so safe in liquids. This probably includes this. <laughs> H2O. That water's far too hot for our swimming pool. Oh, okay. Apparently they can detect that, so I guess I will not be opening it after all. Like, the door is like, okay, I'm not gonna open because the pig said so. Oh, that is bullshit. Like, right at the very instant I get out of the shack, he decides to attack me. Why do this, game? While you do this. Okay, let, let's go back to being ourselves. Of course, there, there was another, like, a water pond that I can deal with. So why don't I deal with that right now? I'm sure Banjo will be able to do that. Well, Kazooie can't. So I guess we'll split up again. And again, we'll go this way. Hopefully we can deal with that dragon real soon, because having to deal with this bullcrap every 10 seconds is going to be a problem. Aw, that poor fish. Huh. That poor Jinjo. 
I can't even tell if he was really a red Jinjo, because he's been in that water for so long. I'd imagine he changed color from all the heat. I'm just saying. Okay, we're out of here. Let's go back to being the duo again. Oh, wow. <laughs> Massive slowdown, I'm telling ya. Alright, let's go back to the ground level, shall we? Okay, this is a pretty interesting level. I mean, there's just a lot to do. But the thing is, we're still not that well equipped to deal with everything. Not to mention, there's a dragon that keeps pissing us off. But, maybe we can do something in the Colosseum. Like, on this side. Ooh, everyone's cheering us. That's real nice. Coliseum Kickball Stadium? Well, we already played Kickball, and that was in Mayhem Temple. Do they also play Kickball here? Apparently they do, they got a stadium. What is attacking us from here? Is that the one of those gargoyle heads or something? Where does this lead to? Oh, back here, okay. Have I checked out this area? Is there anything to check out? Oh, that. Thanks. Your uh, service will not be forgotten, such as you getting pecked in the face. <laughs> That's life, man. <laughs> Okay, I think I see where I need grenade eggs. That just gets you regular eggs of any kind. So, uh, pick your poison, I guess. Looks like you would... Oh, wow. It looks like you can, uh, split up here. I don't know what you would need to split up for. Eh, hey, it's a Jinjo! I'll save you. Of course. It was too good to be true. I think it's gargoyle heads that attack you. Oh no, not this again! Yep, this again. Okay, this looks like where the kickball games are being held. Ah, oh my god! Where are you coming from? No, oh, don't hang on to that. I cannot even see where I'm being shot. Oh, one place over there. Just keep yourself moving, I suppose. And then just deal with this all with all this crap. Oh, there's another place I can blow up. Oh, claw clamber boots. Those will allow me to go up. But let me press this first. Oh, that's actually a secret passage that allows me to get to that Jinjo. Unfortunately, I can't do anything about it because that waterfall is a bit too hot. Okay, I think I need the clock clamber boots to uh, get up. Where? It was up this pillar? I think it was up that one. Let's try it. Yep, it is that one. Cool. You piece of crap. Wow. Just wow. Right on the spot. Where did it hit me from? I cannot even see where. And I don't think I'd be safe anywhere to try to hit him. What? I was moving. How did it predict I was going there? Did I manage not to get hit? All right, let's try this again. I think with that statue head gone, I might be able to make it up there without getting shot. Wow. 
these things mean business. Oh, 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 we made it! Yes! Good. We made it, we made it. Let's go over here first. Do a little bit of exploring while we still can. We reached the 20 minute mark right now. Oh, Cheeto Page! Scratch that off the list. Beautiful. Two more and I can get myself a second code. I still need to cash in that uh, first one. I believe I never did that yet. Is that literally all you can do around here? I mean, no, you can definitely play kickball. Wow, I mean, I can't believe I lucked out there. What can I do with this? Oh, wait a minute. I can just sidle onto that. It's over here, then. That almost got me. <laughs> uh, maybe there's something good over here? I'd like to believe so. Oh my god, this was a banjo only switch. That means I gotta go all the way back down and climb onto that chain again. <laughs> Good job. Good job. <laughs> Good job. I don't like you, okay? If I only get rid of you for a few seconds, that's at least a few seconds of satisfaction. Grab onto the chain! Grab onto the chain, Banjo! What's wrong with you? Fine, leap off this rock. Thank you. Dude, you're almost dead. Unfortunately, these gargoyle statues got very good marksmanship. Thank God I grabbed that. Okay, camera angles don't work against me here. Camera angles, please. Okay, Banjo, hit the switch. Let's do this. And it looks like I gotta get up there as Kazooie. Wait a minute, can I do this as Kazooie? Like, is there a way for me to get up there? I would like to believe I could get up there. It's not through here, is it? No, it can't be through here. No, this is like pretty much down at the bottom. Oh god, Kazooie, you're almost dead. Oh, thank god you managed to get through that. Okay, one of the honeycomb pieces fell in the lava. Just be an absolute idiot. Thanks. It's not like I needed it anyway. <laughs> wow. Is it the Cloud Clamber Boots I need to get up there? I'd imagine you do. At least Kazooie is fast for this part. Okay, well, hopefully I'm doing the right thing here. Or maybe there's no way to get through there from this side. Okay, how the hell do I get up there? Or maybe I cannot do that yet. This is literally as high as we can go. Ah, uh, I guess it didn't matter. Maybe you can't do this part yet. Um, how the hell do I get to Mayhem Temple, then? I don't think you do that through here, that's where we started. I mean, you should be able to get to Mayhem Temple. Wait a minute, unless I do this. Nope, that's not a rock you can destroy. Okay. I should have known better. <laughs> Should be a way to get through there. Oh, wait a minute. I think it's through here. 
Hello. This will actually take us to Mayhem Temple. Yeah, that's actually our meal ticket. Whoever thought we'd be back in World 1. But here we are. And we need to be a Stony in order to get the Jiggy in somewhere in World 7. Funny how that works. But that's how it works. So let's do it. We gotta play some more kickball. Remember kickball that we did in what, part 4 or 5? It was pretty early, and let me tell you that much right now. And we're practically well beyond the second half. No, it can't be beyond the second half. After the second half, that's it! <laughs> that's how halves work. Okay, we're really coming full circle here. Well, it's good to know we'll still be in this transformation in this world. So, let's move on up. Wow! Two of them shot at the same time! And I got a bit of desync at that very moment, so give me a moment to get this fixed. Okay, I'm back. Let's continue on here. If you're wondering why I'm in the middle of this dialogue, it's because I was just moving to uh, dodge the fireballs and I happened to trigger the dialogue automatically. Apparently, they do things a little differently where the lowest score wins kickball in half in hail fire peaks i'm said half fire peaks that's wrong all right so basically anything that gets you points like the yellow balls kick them in everyone else's net this ain't the man league now all right oh i forgot where i was wow that they're, they're all wanting to kick it into my my court that's mean Okay, I'm not doing too well here. Okay, we gotta do better here. Yeah, keep kicking into each other's nets, I don't care. Purple one definitely needs some more points. Uh-oh. Okay, red needs it. Red needs it. Oh, I missed the ball? I had the ball. I guess where I had it. Uh, informal protest, guys. <laughs> oh, let's try this again. At least you get infinite chances at the quarterfinal, because apparently they don't advance the bracket until you win. Video game logic. Why did I stop that? You know what I should be doing? I should just be playing goalie. Like, rather than just try to shoot into, like, uh, everyone's nets all the time, I should just be blocking mine. There we go, that's better. Give me the, uh, Frank Zelke trophy right now. <laughs> Best defensive forward in the league. Except not really. That has nothing to do with kickball. <laughs> Well, like, all three of you are just ganging up on each other, like, ganging on a ball. It's, it's like, a terrible snuff film. Yeah! <laughs> Alright, there we go. That's one victory. You've won your quarterfinal. Now you may move on to the semifinals. Alright, let's do it. Remember, they're gonna be bringing in the red balls. If you have red balls, you see a doctor. Uh, let's just, uh, deal with this now. You're playing with the big boys now. Dude, I got a bigger nose than you, okay? Oh, God! What the hell happened here? It's like everybody starts at 50 points. Okay, so basically what you gotta do... Kick all the balls into your court. So far, I got like 37. Okay, we got 35. Oh, off the side. Oh, wow, I can't believe I missed that. Okay. Yellow one is starting to catch up. Okay, I think I did it. 
No buzzy beaters, because apparently balls disintegrate at zero seconds. That is also a medical problem. <laughs> the Coliseum Kickball Final awaits. Finally, once we get this done, I'm calling it an episode. Because I felt like we accomplished quite a bit. So, let us get on it, shall we? I'm pretty sure bombs are going to be introduced now. Same as it was in the uh, Mayan Finals. You'll ever be the costume champion! Huh, try me! The game gives me infinite chances! Oh god, these bombs are huge! Oh, I got three of us at the same time! There we go. Wait, why did I kick the red ones in there? That's not how things go. Okay. Oh, they practically neutralize each other. Don't you try kicking out of mine. There we go. Ho, ho, ho. I almost lost it there. I declare you the new Coliseum Kickball Champion. Do we get a trophy? Of course. <laughs> well, you pretty much have to right now. I could have swore, thank God for invincibility time, because both of those hit me. Uh, I think now would be a good time to call it an episode, so in the next part I'll meet you back here, you know, as regular Baron Bird. See ya, everyone.